What will happen if you scout Kentucky bluegrass in the middle of summer in the transition zone? Let's figure it out. So in a bit of frustration with my ego mower, which man, I'm quite disappointed in, I gotta tell you, one year later. Went ahead and broke the real mower out. Gave Hell Strip number two a good trim. Of course, it was not used to it, so it's got a lot of yellowing stuff in it. Uh, I, I suppose that's like dormant grass or something going on there. Hopefully it recovers. I don't know if it will. I'm gonna go ahead and give it some Milorganite because it's so hot and uh, see what happens. If it recovers, now we're about halfway through the summer anyway. As far as the hottest months, it's still gotta be in the 90s all the way up until September here in Missouri. But if this does good in the next couple weeks, one week maybe, I'm just gonna go ahead and scalp everything. Scalp it because I'm, I'm so sick and tired of long grass. It just sucks. I can't stand long grass. No matter how lush and cool and soft it is, which by the way, long mazama is really soft. It really is. For every, anyone wondering, it, it feels perfectly fine, just like any Kentucky bluegrass. But short grass is just, once you have it, you, you can't go back. You, you just can't go back. Uh, the other thing I wanted to point out is here in the health strip, Look at all this damage here. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's damage. And it hit me, I don't know why I didn't think about it before, that I did three plots here two years ago. Mazama, Bewitched, combination Mazama, Bewitched. And wouldn't you know, this plot right here, the one, two, three sidewalk squares is, is all Bewitched. And it's certainly, there's certainly a correlation there. That says something. Uh, you know, it, it might be just that area gets more water, but I actually, I, I know it doesn't because I watch it all the time. If, if anything, the top gets more water and way down here, that's water damage right there, water and, and car damage. But, so that's quite interesting. And so we'll see how this does here in the coming months. Uh, and it's just a situation at that point. The other thing, another dog spot. I got my wise camera set up, but uh, even when you have the technology, you just don't get around to, to reviewing it. And man, I, you need to pay for the subscription to, to find each motion tracked event. Otherwise you just need to scrub through days of activity. I don't have the time for that for a stupid dog spot. It's gotta take me more time to to find the event of the dog peeing, then it will just fix it. Just put some seed down this fall and fix it. Anyway, that's it. Uh, we'll see you later, everyone. So I had the idea of storing this fertilizer, this bucket for a garage organization. Uh, problem is, humidity gets to it. So now it's all clumped up, and it kind of feels like kind of like that um, kinetic sand, actually. Now that I think about it. So I'm trying to get this pool cue in here. And Stir it up a bit. Try to break it up. I need to uh, maybe like put this in the oven or something. 